Okay, YouTubers, so I ran out of petrol today when I was driving this little go-kart around, or when my brother was driving this little go-kart around, and I thought, I wonder what would happen if I put some kerosene and some mineral turpentine in there, whether she'd run or not. So anyway, I only had what was left in my kerosene blowtorch, at about an inch on the bottom, so first of all I tipped that in the tank, and then I tipped about oh, two inches off the top of this bottle into the tank. So that's half filled the tank there. And surprisingly, this mower, this engine, runs just the same, if not smoother, on this kerosene and uh, turpentine mix than it does on straight petrol. The only thing is it's a lot more gutless than it used to be, so as soon as you go and let the clutch there out, is if you don't have enough revs at it, it'll stall. But I might as well take you for a bit of a drive and I'll show you what a uh, Briggs and Stratton engine is like when it's running on turpentine and kerosene. Okay, so I've just pushed it out of its little home over there. We'll see if it starts. It never really started very well because the engine needs new rings and it's very worn. Burns about a litre of oil every two or three hours of running, so it's not in very good condition. But anyway. She should start up. There we go. All right, so we'll go for a bit of a drive. See, that's the only problem. That as soon as you pop the clutch, she conks straight out if you don't have enough revs at her. So I might have to drive with two feet today, but anyway. Okay, so now I'll restart her on 90% um, turpentine and 10% kerosene. And I guarantee you, it is 90% turpentine, and it actually runs surprisingly well, so let's give it a go. Okay, I'll give it a bit of a rest. It's a little bit sort of gutless compared to what it used to be, but still runs all right considering what it's running on, probably about three octane. And anyway, so there you go. That's a Briggs and Stratton lawnmower engine, just a standard lawnmower engine, no modifications whatsoever, except it's got two holes drilled in the exhaust and um, a foot throttle mechanism over there. Because this is my little brother and sister's go-kart they ride around the joint on it you know around the driveway and shit so anyway <laughs> I thought it was quite interesting that it actually run on you know run on turpentine and kerosene anyway see you later